Hey, welcome back to the show. Jesus, what's going on, man? What's going on, Niggas man? Bonded in. We don't need that. I like this shot. Let me just take a picture. We're eating a pizza. We just had some ice cream. We're about to go and party. This is barbecue sauce, mozzarella, chicken, bacon, and pineapple. It's really good. But we got to get where we're going. We're just going to enjoy the sunset for a minute. Enjoy the slice. Maybe one more song. And I think we're going to hit the road after that. That's a good one. Ooh, we're going to party. It's time. We're going to go find Gigi. Pardon me, guys. Where is a good place to park? Are you guys good people? Where should? Who's cool? Who should I park next to? Like, where's the best place to park? They seem pretty cool over there. They're the ones that, like, organize it over there. I'm going to go park over there because... What's your name, buddy? I'm Todd. <laughs> good to meet you. you were Joe's old roommate, weren't you? Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry about Did that. we meet before? I'm no, I'm sorry, too. Man, that was a hell no, of a time. No, I, I used to live in that apartment before you moved in there. We talked about this before. Yeah. I remember this briefly. We'll connect soon. And meanwhile, yeah, I'm, I'm going to go. This is Amber. I'm Garrett. I'm Todd. It's so nice We're going to gonna have you. such a good time tonight. Absolutely. Absolutely. Positives and negatives and negatives and positives and everything's great. Are you staying for the weekend? I think just tonight. I'm going to Denver tomorrow. Hmm? Are you playing? No, I, know, I could. I, mean, I liked your music setup. Though. I saw your. Uh, Thank you. I have a bunch of. Uh, I love. I love making music. So well, I, I, I like seeing all that. Well, I have a cajon, egg shakers, a slide whistle, a kazoo, and more egg shakers, and a bass guitar and a try, acoustic. You gotta try the cajon. You'd like the cajon. You're gonna love it. We missed the yawn. Damn it. Hashtag spa day. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Are you going to say obey above it? <laughs> Is that Andre Shepherd the Giant? Shepherd fairy. I love that you know that because no one knows that story. Really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so, the mural arts program is like based all the stuff out of it. Yeah. So I'm going to tell the story as you draw this. Okay. So Banksy's exit through the gift shop. Shepherd fairy talking about his Andre the Giant obey. But like also it's a reference from They Live. The John Carpenter film from the 1980s. About how it's like the Illuminati controlling the people. Kind of overheard that tone, but I haven't heard that specific origin. Though. We'll talk more about it in the future. So, what do you know about Shepherd Fairy? Tell us about This is a Shepherd Fairy story. Ten years ago, I was at this mural arts convention thing in Philly. And uh, that's kind of where I learned about the whole origin of... Uh, I go bay, and uh, they had all the mur murals out there. That was super, super cool. And uh, from there, that's kind of all I got for you. So, yeah, like, was... the main thing is that, like, if you're wearing something, you should know what you're wearing, though, too, right? And a lot of people don't know, like, the Obey Shepherd Fairy. They just wear it because it's a brand. It's like gotcha. Supremes. But people should know what they're doing. People should know what they're doing. <laughs> give me, uh, give me some keywords. Some Bananas. Keywords. Bananas. Limes. Limes? Okay. Key word is limes. Key word is limes. All right. Yeah, it begins. Fire at one minute and 30 seconds. There's another doe.
<laughs> See how my body's twisted? And then, get that weave. You can just come from this side. You can sweep and go over. And once you get that sweep over, then you can, then you know how to put it behind your head. Once you know how to put it behind your head, then you can get more complicated with that. Yeah, it's a color. It's not a number. Oh my goodness. Have you ever done that? <laughs> Don't get me started. <laughs> So it's been really funny. I've been kind of telling people, I'm like, yeah, like, I might be famous soon. And it's weird because, like, I can. And, like, I, I, don't th I don't know if that's what I want. I don't think that's what I want. But, like, I don't know what else to do. I can't keep working at the grocery store. I can't keep living this situation at home and Craig. But, yeah, it's really cool, like, meeting people that are like, I want you to be a part of this. I want you to do what you can do and help us both grow and, like do these things that are fun. If it happens, it's gonna be weird, man. I don't know, I'm just, I'm having ideas right now in my head of like Hooski's setup. I haven't seen their spot yet, but just like having TVs with background things and like having cell phones on every table that are like mini computers that are like, cool, like here, like you can change the music or like having like different rooms if there's like different portions of it. It's like, cool, like here's this music room, here's that music room. But like having locally made music like available on all the phones so you can like change the song if you want to but like it's all stuff that like you can't find on the internet you can only find it here and that kind of being the idea of being like well like licensing and privacy you know everyone's used to Spotify it's like well like like no like come to Steamboat but then that makes more people come to Steamboat and that's money and that kind of destroys it being a ski town damn it that's a good looking mountain <laughs>